Hello friends! Animal hybrids almost always look very unusual and even extravagant. The ancient mythology of different cultures is full of strange hybrid creatures such as centaurs, mermaids, manticores, harpies, and sirens. However, nature also has its own hybrids, real living creatures. Some hybrids appear naturally. Others are bred by scientists, and I'll tell you about them in today's video. Jag Lion This animal is a hybrid of a male jaguar and a female lion. Jag Lion has the powerful jaguar physique, while the color of its coat has features of both types. It got the color from the lion and brown rosettes from the jaguar. Two Jag Lions were born in a Canadian reserve in April of 2006. They were born as a result of unintentional mating between a male jaguar and a tame lioness. Savannah If you're a fan of exotic cats, you have probably heard about the Savannah Cat. These creatures were born thanks to the long and difficult work of professional breeders. This is a hybrid of a Siamese cat and a serval. In fact, it's more like a miniature copy of a serval. This breed has many fans as these cats are very graceful, playful, and very attached to people. Bengal Cat This is another relatively new but quite popular breed. It was successfully bred in the United States by crossing an Asian leopard cat with a domestic cat. They are playful, energetic, and highly intelligent creatures. Their distinctive feature is their extreme talkativeness. Bengal cats can make a wide variety of sounds, reminiscent of bird chirps or even creaks. <coughs> Zubron It is a hybrid of a domestic cow and a European bison. Attempts to crossbreed these animals were made for a long time, but a Polish scientist managed to successfully do it only in the middle of the 19th century. At the end of the 80s of the last century, the results of the hybridization of these animals were found unsatisfactory and the breeding of Zubrons was prohibited. Liger The Liger is a hybrid of a lion and a tigress and has almost no mane at all, but it can swim and loves doing it. The Liger is similar to the extinct cave lion, a huge cat that looks a lot like a lion but with blurry stripes and no mane. You won't find it in wildlife. After all, lions are mainly found in Africa and tigers live in Asia. Meanwhile, lions and tigers are continuously housed together in zoos and circuses, and one to two percent of those couples have offspring. So today, there is no more than two dozen ligers in the world. Male ligers don't have offspring, but females can. They can mate with a lion and give birth to a liliger. Koi dog. And this is a hybrid of a dog and a coyote. Despite the fact that these animals are very similar genetically, they rarely interbreed in nature. These hybrids can look different. Some of them look more like domestic dogs, while others look more like coyotes. It is also difficult to predict what kind of character the koi dog will have. There's no way to know in advance whose genes will prevail. Koi Wolf A much more formidable hybrid is the Coyote Wolf Mix. These animals are common in the northeastern United States and southeastern Canada because crossbreeding occurs naturally. Kai wolves are always much larger than coyotes. Unlike wolves, these animals almost never attack humans. They also get the absence of fear towards humans from coyotes, and thus they often enter the villages. Wolf Dog Today, Wolf Dog, full name the Czechoslovakian Wolf Dog, is a new officially recognized breed of dogs, which arose as a result of an experiment carried out in 1955 in Czechoslovakia. Wolf Dog is a hybrid of a German Shepherd Dog and a Carpathian Wolf. The goal of this crossbreeding was to create a breed with the temperament, herd feeling, and trainability of a German Shepherd and the strength, physique, and endurance of a wolf. Tigen 
If the cub's father is a lion and its mother is a tigress, the cub is called a liger. And if it's the other way around, the father is a tiger and the mother is a lioness, then it's called a tigan. Interestingly, ligers are the largest cats in the world, while tigans, on the contrary, are always smaller than both tigers and lions. Just like the liger, the tigan can't be found in the wild. These animals can only be seen in reserves. Lepin And this is a hybrid of a male leopard and a lioness. Lepins are larger than leopards, but smaller than lions. The first documented case of the birth of a lepin occurred in India in 1910. Two lepin cubs were born in Mumbai. Then breeding the lepins became popular with European zoos. But despite numerous attempts, none of the cubs reached puberty. Walfin This is a hybrid of a female common bottlenose dolphin and a male false killer whale. There are only two of these rare hybrids that live in the Sea Life Park in Hawaii. Their mother was a wolfin, so her calves are only a quarter whale and three quarters dolphin. Narluga. Another very rare hybrid breed is created by crossbreeding a narwhal, a medium-sized mammal with a tusk, and a beluga whale, an arctic and subarctic toothed whale from the same family as narwhal. Narlugas are extremely rare in nature, but there has been an interesting trend in recent years of increasing cases of sightings of these hybrid animals in the North Atlantic. Monkey I don't even know what animal this monkey had to be crossbred with to get so many eyes. Only a spider has eight eyes, but how do you crossbreed a primate and an insect? Zo is like a bull, only better. It is a hybrid between a yak and domestic cattle. Although it looks more like a hybrid between a bull and a horse because it has the horse's tail. In terms of the meat and milk quality, these animals are superior to ordinary cows. As a result, hybrids don't reproduce well, but the opposite is true for the zoo. They have more calves in their lifetime than cows do. Beefalo Another domestic cattle hybrid is a crossbreed of a bull and a bison. Beefalo was bred on purpose. It took a long time and persistence and a goal to breed an animal that could live outside, eat only plants, and get this food on its own, even in winter from under the snow, as bison do. Beefalo has a strong constitution, docile disposition, and resistance to many diseases. Mule Mules are born from the mating of a male donkey and a mare. Mules are more patient, resilient, and hardy than horses, and they also live longer than horses. They are considered to be less stubborn, quicker, and smarter than donkeys. These hybrids are prized for their developed packing abilities. Mules usually weigh 370 to 460 kilograms. Grolar A rare hybrid of a male grizzly bear and a female polar bear. Although the two species are genetically similar and are often found in the same areas, they usually avoid each other and have different breeding habits. Grizzlies live and breed on land, while polar bears prefer to do it on ice. Growlers can exist in both captivity and in the wild. Most polar grizzlies, as the growlars are sometimes called, live at the zoos, but there have been a few instances when they have been spotted in the wild. An Alaskan hunter shot one in 2006. Their looks resemble both polar and grizzly bears, but their behavior is more similar to that of the polar bear. Friends, that's all for today. Like the video, subscribe to our channel, and see you soon.